The newest crime-fighting tool fits in the palm of your hand. It's not a weapon, and even though it's used by soldiers and now police, it's talking its way in and out of some sticky situations. Jaime Marti joins us now with more. Although it's finding a translator isn't always easy to do, but now local law enforcement has one at their fingertips. At first look, it's like an oversized palm pilot. This is a quick fix for a quick situation. It's called the phrase later. First developed for combat use so American soldiers could communicate with Afghans and Iraqis. So far, the only law enforcement agency using the phrase later in Florida is in Lee County. At a cost of $2,500, the county has two of the translation devices. Both are used at the county jail. We might have a person in here from Germany on vacation, gets arrested, has a medical emergency in our cell. We can't communicate with them to see what's wrong with them, but this tool will allow us to be able to communicate effectively and quickly with that person. Since the device was originally made for patrols, the phrase later had to be updated with new phrases and questions for jail use. Captain Everhart helped develop the software. Basically, I made um, multiple modules with a um, couple hundred phrases on it to be able to use in uh, different facilities for different functions, booking, intake, release. Um, medical, uh, for medical emergencies, just permanent questions to ask. In addition to communicating with inmates, this phrase later can also be used for anyone who would come up to this counter, for instance, and had a question and couldn't speak English. El estado de Veracruz, Mexico. Versatility is the goal here. From simple questions to commands that could save someone's life. You might give a lawful command to somebody and before you, you have a use of force or a, a, a chemical spray on them, you want to make sure that person understands your, your lawful commands. Communication technology designed to avoid miscommunication. Oh, get this. In the event of a riot or civil unrest, the phrase later can be connected to a loudspeaker. Now, here in Lee County, it has a library of phrases in Spanish, French, German, Russian, and Creole. Now, right now, the phrase later only asks questions or phrases that have been programmed into the device.